what is deadlock we will see now how you will get a deadlock in our uh, environment in mysql server we will see what is meant by deadlock first of all we need to know about that most of the cases in interviews also uh, what is meant by deadlock they will be asking how you can see that how you can able to identify deadlock is happened or not these things you will get a questions normally here example i am saying a user is there a user one is there and user two is there two users are there there is a table there is a table is there one more table is also there same table also we can discuss about that this is different table now one fellow is accessing this table called table name i can say student table i can say that okay this guy also is updating some is die also same is updating something on this guy is updating on row id equal to 1 this guy also trying to update on row id different row id on 3 then you won't get any problem or second record no problem once done that is fine suppose this guy will try to this guy will try to update same row same row he is trying to update that this guy this user 2 is trying to access this row 1 same row okay what is happening here user 1 is trying to access row id 2 user 2 is trying to access row id 1 before that only he is working on row id 1 and before that this guy is working on row id 2 this is the thing happened in this case then automatically this guy is trying to access this one this guy is trying to access this one then you will face a deadlock here deadlock here that is the thing this is not uh, like a DBA related, this is like a development side, but you have to identify, okay, whether uh, deadlock is happened or not, you have to identify that, fine, I will show you the example, here you can see the example, I am creating a table and inserting two records, okay, see here. I am in user 1, uh, which database you can use, any database you can use, uh, show databases, uh, you can use Snapdeal, okay, in this you can use this one creating insert two records okay id1 id2 insert two records and then then select and verify that normal these two records are there now go to the begin statement to do any transactions if you want to do begin transaction updating id1 you are updating id1 marks minus 12 okay updated 
obviously open second window see the first one second is doing his activity i told right second is doing on second record he is not no oh, see oh sorry you have to select snap deal database right second record he did then again he is trying to access first one see this it is why because of already that guy is working on that then first window fellow is trying to access on second one see deadlock has been identified like this you can try example fine i'll give you the script in below the comments you can try and exit then if I, your uh, boss is asking how to identify the deadlock because developer to developer dba cannot able to see that right then how to do i'll show you let it be first verify in your it has to record in your error log go and see this okay shift g oh, access denied something it is there but it deadlock is not showing here it's not recorded then how you should do that if you want to record whether deadlock has happened or not show variables like just you can give like this okay this is of ino db print all underscore deadlocks okay this is off if you make it on set global then it will record okay you can try it if you have any doubts you can comment me i will reply on that thank you